At Nuneaton's George Eliot Hospital, consultant diabetes physician Dr Vinod Patel has developed some simple tools to help patients understand a little better their condition and its impact on their lives. We have to reassure people that diabetes is a relatively common condition uh, in UK. So we have to get the patient used to the diagnosis of diabetes, what it means in terms of a change in lifestyle, particularly diet. And do most people think it's, it's going to change their lives forever? It will change their lives, for sure, because they have, they have to remember at all times that they have diabetes. However, the changes that we make in terms of lifestyle are really quite general. And really, most of us should be living the sort of diabetic-type life, as it were. Now, this is a care plan, and what we've attempted to do here is to focus on all the main aspects of care in a patient with diabetes. So, and this is our alphabet strategy, actually. So A's advice, so we're focusing there on diet and exercise, not smoking, driving safely, B's for blood pressure, C's cholesterol, D's diabetes control, E is making sure that your eyes are checked regularly, F is making sure that your feet are checked regularly, and G is the idea of guardian drugs like statins and ACE inhibitors that protect you from uh, future harm. I think the exciting thing in diabetes is that there is now very good evidence that if we were to control all these risk factors, then the chances of getting any complication of diabetes under the age of 75 is reduced by at least 50%. And what's this, I mean, is this to do with diabetes? Uh, it is actually. This is a model that we sometimes use for education. In fact, it's made by uh, the carer of one of our patients. So you can see that the blood pressure goes up as we go from here to here, and the diabetes control gets worse as we go from here to here. So if your diabetes is not controlled and your blood pressure is high, then you've got a very high risk of having complications. And that's why we have a red bar here and it's quite tall. But as the diabetes control improves and the blood pressure uh, improves as well, you can see that you're passing through an amber zone where the chances of complications is much less to a green zone where the chances of complications is minimized. We need to get the patient to have as normal a life as, as possible with minimal interference in terms of diet, exercise, and other things that they want to do. And we want our patients to help them safely achieve whatever they want to do. We've had patients skydiving, we've had patients climbing mountains, skiing, uh, doing a whole variety of different jobs. So really it's just to help our patients uh, through their normal lives.